So the tanks we have them set up in are basically nursery tanks. They have some rocky uh, habitat so that the turtles can crawl up and of course get to the air source because they are air breathers. These are not, uh, these aren't turtles that have, turtles in general don't have lungs. So they can't breathe underwater. But what we have noticed is that these baby turtles will wedge themselves underwater for extended periods of time. And they're very deliberate about their actions. And if you look at their, their feet, you can see that they're designed to hold themselves underwater if they want to. They're also designed to be very good swimmers. So in the tanks we set up, we made uh, sure that they had a current as part of the filtration system, which helps keep the tank nice and clean. It also provides a current so that these little turtles get a lot of experience swimming. We want them to be very strong and as healthy as they would have been if they had been raised in their marsh environment. And even on the plastron, which is the belly shell, we have this wonderful pattern. And then a different nest will have much more subdued, subdued markings, darker in general, less distinction, darker skin color. You can see the belly shell pattern is very different. So we've been very interested to see how different each of these nests come out looking.